Bill is going to throw a hook punch. We're just going to do it real slow motion here. What I'm doing in this drill on this stick or baton or whatever object you're going to carry in center grip, this could represent that you have a shorter stick or that you just grabbed it off the ground and you just happen to pick it up in this position. It might have been beside your seat. It might have been just when you stood up and you have something like in the center grip position. Um, Bill's going to throw a, back, a right hand hook punch here. So typically you're going to block it like this, but in this case here, we're going to parry it over. So if I did block it, I'm going to parry it over with the elbow. Or if he does it again, my hands might have already been down. I just bring my hands up and I'm just going to go in this position here. When I pass it here, I can just go behind him. And then what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to put it on my elbow here. This is called the cobra. The hands here, this is the cobra's head. And I just push into the choke position also pull him with the knee and really pull him back. If I have the stick in the right hand and he punches me with the left side, I might have brought the stick up and just parried it here. And in this case, I'm just going to slide it across with the palm up. Now I have it reversed. Earlier, I did it this direction going around. This time, I'm kind of doing it palm up and, and um, opposite side. So this second hand is going to cross over and it's going to squeeze in this position. So your hands end up being in this cross position here. The first drill was this to this, and that was the choke. This one is this position to that position. And we'll demonstrate from the opposite side. If Bill doesn't hook from that side, I might just bring the hand up and parry it. I'm just gonna, this might be a whack to the temple or the throat, or I might have missed and just passed it through here. The second hand's just gonna shoot to the moon. It's just gonna come straight up, and the hand that's on top is the cobra's head striking, which goes on the top of his. My left hand pulls while my right hand punches. And Go very gentle, we're not even going to put that much pressure just to show you. He knows it's going to hurt if I continue. And then Bill's going to do it to me, so what I'm going to do here, or I'm sorry, let me do one more from the other side. So this time the fist comes, let's punch with that side. So you can see, I can cross it over and pass it through, or you know, if it hit the, the knuckles, it's fine, but I might have just come up and just passed it. Then I'm going to do palm up, the other hand goes palm down, and he types it in the sweeps. And I'll have you demonstrate here. So the first one's gonna be this hand here. My right hand's gonna be passed by his empty hand. So it comes over, and then the stick just comes, comes across and he's gonna do the cobra. There's the choke. And then we're gonna do, coming from this side, so now the stick's gonna come up and the stick's gonna pass it that way. And he's gonna do a palm up, so a cross grip, so pull back. And there it is. So again, you don't need a long stick to do these. If you did it with a long stick, it's gonna work fine as well, but we're just demonstrating from the center grip position because you wanna practice with it. So in slow motion, if you're practicing by yourself, just visualize the, the uh, hand came on this side, I parried it, I can bring it up here, and I can do it this way, or I can pass it with the stick, bring it up this way, or I can pass it with the stick, come around and pull it, or I can pass it with the hands, come around and pull it this way, or that transitions into this cobra choke pull position. It's always a pull push. So practice on that drill from the center grip.